I was smoking a cigarette with my right hand, and I shot the basketball with my left hand, and I made it in the hoop. It was really cool. Hmm. Anyways, what are we talking about? Situations. Yeah. Basically, it's a very repetitive song because that's, like, pretty much the nature of the lyrics and everything. It's, like, you know, repetitively just, like, being like, oh, my God, I have to avoid this situation. I thought of something that's really funny is uh, we might, me and Sydney might have had our first real um, fight in the studio recording situations. I don't remember yeah. this. Um, it wasn't, like, a fight, but God, it was I a verbal assault. It. Like right before we were we tracked got the track. I was uh you know, they were stifling me creatively, obviously. No. Uh, (laughs) No, but they I was I used to overplay drums and I still do sometimes, a lot of times, but back then I was wanting to play a lot of fills and they were like, No fills. The song, no fills. I was like, What? (laughs) No fills? No fills, no fun. No fills, yeah, but you listen to that song and you'll hear Right where there would be a fill, it's like, rest. Yeah. <laughs> I was, uh, yeah. I don't know. You can hear it. I was anger. mad. Like, <laughs> the energy of it. But yeah, me and Sydney argued about it for a little bit in the studio. That's and how I was great like, songs are made, though. Yeah. Tense situations, mm-hmm. you know. Oh, my God, situations. Wow. <laughs> Full circle. <Whoa. laughs> we talk about the title of quiche mountain oh quiche mountain what does it mean it's like the same as kosh kush kosh quiche i said quiche quiche zish zosh zosh um zish tonomorph bay (laughs) zish tonomorph bay survivor if any of that rings a bell that that should clear it up for you that's what quiche is if you have to ask, you will never know. Yeah, it's like a feeling that you can't put your finger on. Yep, that's geesh. Or a finger that you can't put your feeling on. Um, something about Quiche Mountain is uh, it's a hodgepodge of songs. Um, three of them, you know, recorded a long time ago. One of them more recently. And uh, we didn't have a place to put them as far as an album. And we were kind of scared that they would get just swept away and then we would work on new material and then they the wave goodbye to those songs because we'll never release them and yeah. quiche mountain became its uh its home too to many those. songs have disappeared into the other mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. it bums us out like pretty little liars <laughs> like the characters come and go cameron loves pretty little liars right mm-hmm. now this is his favorite show yeah so it was it was pretty tight that we uh gave him a home and it was awesome. Fire Talk was down to, you know, put it out there. Mm-hmm. One, two, three. Thank, Thank you, Fire Talk, Talk Records. Yeah. <laughs> but we have been noticing that every other Fire Talk artist has hats. And we don't have <laughs> any hats. <laughs> we need a hat, Trevor. <laughs> Thanks for listening to our songs in this podcast. Yep. I'm going to chug this claw. Um, shout out, talks. shout out, uh, Nick Roder for recording them. Yeah. And shout out Johnny Shinky for mastering them and mixing them. And uh, a shout out Fire Talk and all the other cool ass bands on the label. Yeah, for real. Can't wait to meet them all in person. Mm-hmm. Eventually. Yeah. Someday my prince will come. Thank you.